Hello everybody, welcome to episode 7. We are back at the mountain which contains Heidi Hole. We're here with Troublemaker the Cow and the Killer Bunnies, which sounds like some sort of weird college rock band. Troublemaker Cow and the Killer Bunnies, coming soon to an SU bar near you. Uh, meanwhile, what I'm doing here today, I've been doing some off-camera inventory, collecting some cobblestone, some wood, I've got some acacia wood as well, I'm sure I'll figure out something to do with that. Um, the reason behind this madness, just collecting resources for the beginnings of construction at the village. I've decided that I, I want to keep going with Heidi Hole, I don't want to just abandon it and never come back here again. So Heidi Hole is now going to be our main construction facility for collection of resources for use in the village. So we'll be getting wood from here, I've got some trees, I'm just going to plant some more. And um, let's think about this, here should be good, uh, it's finding places where there's nothing that will get in the way. There should do, um, we should be able to grow one there as well, I don't think that's too close to the one I've just planted, here looks good. Let's plant one here. Come here. I've got one more left, and you can go. I think you can go here. So I've got some wood that I've collected. I want to keep that as wood because while I'm planning to build, um, one of the things I want to build is a pumpkin farm. But I want to keep it. I want to be in keeping with the design of the farms, which are already at the village. So it will be the, the, I think they're cobblestone walls and then a wooden layer at the top with dirt in the middle. <coughs> Let's get some food, what shall I eat? Let's eat some chicken. Yay, chicken. Um, so been yeah, a good week since I last played Minecraft. I know I uploaded a video on Saturday, but that was because I forgot time some stuff and we'll get going. Um, I uploaded a video on Saturday but the that was actually a video that I recorded oh I've got 21 iron in there a video that I recorded a good week or so ago um, and the reason it's just been I had a, a big uh, writing project for work this week and so I, I've been all of my free Minecraft time has been spent working on that instead. Oh, I've done it again. I've misjudged how much time I had. Um, so yeah, that's why I've not been playing Minecraft this week, but it, the project is now, well, it's not finished, but it's reached a point where I can't do any more until I've had some input from someone else who won't be back at work until Wednesday. So I'm free to play Minecraft. Yippee! <laughs> I have got other projects as well, but they're not work related, they are personal related. I've got some manuscripts I want to work on, stuff like that. But I've been itching to get on with the Minecraft stuff all week pretty much, so let's just carry on with it. Get it out of, get it out of my system and then we'll carry on. I think I've gone the, have I gone the wrong way? I'm heading, I'm heading west. Oh. I think I've gone... I'm heading west, but I think I've gone too far. Oh no, there it is. Just come Hi guys! Is my, is my bed still in the library? Cool. Um, actually, I won't, I'm not going to sleep just yet, because... It, it, the worst case scenario is I die and I'll spawn back at Heidi Hole, which is where I slept last. So let's carry on with today's project. So I think I think I said, I can't remember, I want to build a pumpkin farm, but I want to be keeping the aesthetics of the existing farm here. And I said cobblestone walls. I've noticed these are actually dirt walls, but I'm not 
I'm not a fan of that. I'd rather have cobblestone walls. So I'm going to go through the process of replacing these eventually with my chosen design. So replacing all the dirt with cobblestone. But it, before I do that, let's get started with a <coughs> pumpkin farm. So I think if we do it over here, over here will be good. And I don't want to be too close to the wall. Let's do here. So four, one, two, three. I'm going to think about where the water's going to be. So we want that the edge there, and then we've got dirt, 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 water, dirt, 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 edge. Okay. And then if we continue on. Be enough. So we've got a good foundation here now. So the next step is we want to just get this completely flawed. Oh, we'll have to dig you up. Oh, that's made it nice and dark. Um, let's pop a torch down there for now. going to lay a floor here and I will eventually probably do this with all the farms but it's one one crazy project at a time I think right so that's that next we need the wood and knowing my luck I don't have enough hello how are you yeah do you come here often yeah me too oh there's an enderman behind you it actually looks like a tiny enderman. That's like a baby enderman over there. I don't think you can get them. I hope you can't get them. The adult ones are enough. Uh, so we're just going to go around as per before. Have I got enough? Yes, I've got plenty. Hooray! And now the dirt. Such an emergency if I run out of dirt because I can get plenty more. One, two, three, water. One, two, three. I forgot my math wrong then for a second. Of course, the other advantage of doing this is that I can check on villager security as well. Oh, Sunny's awake. Hello Sunny, how are you? Yeah, I know. Right, where should I grab some soil from? Well, I'm going to do this eventually. So slowly but surely replace the farm and get some soil while we're at it. I'm not I'm really concerned with grabbing the soil that's under there. Right. And I've got my bucket, so the next thing we need to add is water. So let's go, there's quite a few water sources around here. Let's uh, locate. Oh, where are they? Are they inside the village? Yes. And I note with the stain that my golem is doing bugger all about it. Right, so that's probably because it's quite dark here. Oh. Okay, we have got... That was a skeleton that spawned there then. So there's this dark patch here. At least I can't hear any doors breaking, which is good. Ow! Oh. We are getting quite a lot of spawn in here actually. Oh. 
You, you are on the other side of the wall, right? You may, you, you may remain. You are right next to the wall. You're making me nervous, so I'm going to kill you. Sorry. Hmm. Oh, he gave me some zombie flesh. That was nice of him. How much have I got? Six. doing in here? Head count, you're fine. Head count in here, you're fine. I wanna, oh, actually now I think about it, it gets quite dark in here. Oh, I did place a torch. I remember thinking it gets really dark in that blacksmith, so I must place a torch. So I must have done that off screen and then forgot about it. Where's Toby? Oh, while I'm here, got some water. <laughs> that was when I set out, wasn't it? Uh, oh, sun's coming up so we can stop panicking for a while. I think we did okay. I think I've already checked these places actually. Yeah. Um, I can't see Toby anymore. Look out in here. Yep. Yeah. Why do you have mushrooms growing on your floor? That that's an issue. You need to get that looked at. Seriously. That's you have hygiene problems, my friend. I'm saying this as your friend. Oh for Christ's sake, right. Okay. Oh oh no. for now. That's killing you. Is the sun getting... It's getting cold. Oh. The sun must be able to get in there. So we're gonna wall up, wall up these zombies in the zombie church, and then think about what we're gonna do with them. Oh, darn, darn, absolute darn. Um, many villagers to spare. I mean we're gonna run out of villagers at this point. We're gonna we're gonna run out of villagers, Toby. This where are they spawning around this church and why are villagers letting them into the damn building? Hello, yeah I know, I know, I know some of the zombies got turned into villagers. Yes it's my fault. I said I was going to defend you. I failed, I got cocky. I'm annoyed. You may have told by the tone of my voice, but we will figure this out. I'm, I'm just going to have to. <laughs> I'm going to have to go into the Nether and figure out how to cure zombies because clearly 
things are going. I was going to use a phrase there, which would not make this a family friendly video. I will leave them in the church for now. The zombie spawn church. Without another portal, there's not much else I can do because I need blaze rod. I need gold as well, and I have got gold somewhere. Oh, I can't remember the rest of the recipe. I can't remember the rest of the recipe for the the cure right now. So I'll need to go away and look that up. <clears throat> I know it's I know it involves blaze rod. It it needs a crafting table. Not crafting table, the the potion version. <laughs> That is annoying. That is that is actually genuinely quite annoying that that's happened. I, that's four villages I've lost, I and mean, hopefully these guys will get started on it. Maybe making some more, but that will mean either I need to get the food inventory up or I need to get trading with them. Have I got emeralds on me? I've got emeralds on me. Again, I need to I need to look up the mechanics because they've changed recently, and I did I have watched the uh, Doc M seventy seven intro, but I wasn't taking notes, so I've only got a vague idea of how to get villagers breeding. I was gonna I was gonna leave that until we had a, a bigger village to play with, but we are we are fast running out of candidates for uh, population growth, so. I'm gonna have to. I think next night, as soon as the sun sets again, I'm gonna have to really look at where I'm not lighting up this place properly. I mean, the, the point of growing the the pumpkins here today was I wanted to build some jack o' lanterns, which that provide uh, off next to um, glowstone which again needs the nether, provides the best light in the game. Um, I'm kind of off kilter now because I had a plan for what I was going to do today and it's been completely thrown by the fact that I have zombies in my church. And do I still have zombies in my church? Yep, there they are. So. This wouldn't be a problem if the villagers weren't stupid and didn't open the doors. Just saying. I have a carrot. That's good. Grow some carrots. I'm not sure if we actually have a carrot farm here. Oh yeah, there's a carrot farm. I wonder if none of the villagers seem to be getting up onto the farm to do any farming. I'm wondering if they don't like hopping up onto the blocks maybe but they hop up they hop up to get into the houses so that's that can't be it <coughs> right let's let's just carry on with the plan so we need pumpkin seeds there we go let's grow our grow our first few pumpkins I just made a pumpkin farm, where did I put it? There it is. So we want to just toil the land. Right, so let's plant some pumpkins and I'm just going to make... Oh, Today, all right. I've been completely thrown by the unexpected developments. So we planted our seed. There we go. So 
that's that working so that's going to hopefully build us some jack-o'-lanterns my next step is going to have to be another portal because I need I'm, I'm going to need to get blaze rod I'm going to need to get nether crack so I can set fire to it I'm going to need glowstone to back up the jack-o'-lanterns so I guess that's the next project. I wasn't going to do it straight away, but c'est la vie. Best laid plans of mice and men. I'm not, I was originally going to build it in the church. Let's assume for the sake of argument that that plan has also been thrown out of the window. So how much time have I got left? Oh, the sun's over there. I'm gonna wait the night out here. I wanna do some more patrolling. Hopefully I won't lose any more villagers. And then in the morning we'll head back to Heidi Hole and we will build a nether portal. I've got an idea of where I'm going to build it um, and how I'm going to build it as well. Because I haven't got a diamond pickaxe. I have the makings of a diamond pickaxe but I don't actually want to <laughs> make one just yet if that makes sense. Because I've, I've not got that much diamond and I would like to save it for building armour, if at all possible, if I can have any say in the matter. So, I have got an idea in my mind of how I'm going to get around that. Don't you worry. to the, uh, the library and oh, zombies I will save you you're both zombie villagers aren't you I'm not going nuts yeah oh you are yeah you're upset how do you think I feel right <clears throat> I've been one that's what's going to the nether to rescue you right Let's make some bread. There we go. And then we want to breed the sheep. And collect some mutton. Because my hunger is sort of low. You may have noticed. Hey, Toby. What a good boy you were. I suppose you killed some. Alright, where are the sheep? There's one. So, love you up. That's the other one. Where is the other one? Oh, there he is. Come here. Ah! Go find that other sheep. friend. You just have one of those days where you wish you hadn't gotten out of bed. It's the I hope there isn't too big a time limit on this. Well, hopefully they'll find each other. In the meantime I have bread to eat. I'll just live off bread the rest of my life. Sun is going down. <sighs> Here we go again. Right, Toby, please just back me up here. Right, where are my torches? There they are.
suppose the advantage of building a village from scratch or a city from scratch is that you can sort of plan your lighting and it works. It works that way. Whereas this, I'm going on what I, where I can place lighting. Well, it's not limited by the layout of the village, but I can't build as I go and light as I go. I'm having to look for dark patches. And round here, we've had spawn round here twice now, so here is definitely where I need to concentrate. I think. torches left. could spawn up there they shouldn't be able to get into the front of the building. I've got more torch makings on me. I have Toby just took out a spider. Well done, man. You know what would be really good? If I could get... Oh, there's the other sheep. Oh, yeah, I remember. I forgot he was stuck up there. What would be really good is if I could get some height on the situation. If only I could access my church. even drop any meat. Okay, things I'm learning today. One, free range sheep, bad idea. Tomorrow we get the sheep into a pen. In fact, let's do that now. Where are the sheep? There you are, hiding in the... I just threw my sword. You are literally the last thing I need right now. Go away, Mr. Enderman. Alright, where's that sheep gone? The no problems keep occurring, so let's just check around here. We would appear to be okay. <laughs> oh, I've lost, I just want to go home. I've lost the sheep now. Oh. Toby's break dancing in the town centre. That's nice. Complete waste of iron you were, weren't you? Oh. There you are. Follow me. Come on. 
Yes. Yeah. Come on. Alright. Finally. Right. Right. There you go. And there you go. Make babies happen. Some more. What is going on? There is an Enderman on the other side of the farm. Fantastic. Right, let's leave him to it. Let's check. Zombies. Zombies over there on fire. Villagers are out. Brilliant. Okay. Doors with green faces in them. No. I already know about that one. Today has been a total disaster, but we did at least build the pumpkin farm. So what I'm going to do now, I've got, so I'm going to head back to the blacksmith's thing and just drop off some inventory, and then head back to Heidi Hole, and from there we will build the Nether Portal, the next step in our crazy adventure. But. I'm getting a bit frustrated for today, so I'm going to call it call that it for now. I've obviously got a lot of reading up to do if we're going to be if we're if we're seriously going to do this if we're seriously going to try and cure the villagers in the church. We kind of have to think about things. I'm going to have to. <laughs> re oh. I must be mad. I mean, completely insane. Mad. Am I really going to do this? Me? I want, I'm going to willingly go into the nether? But they are my villagers. And I said that I would protect them. They... They're gone! Did they? Hang on a minute. Can zombies climb ladders? They've despawned, haven't they? <sighs> so, I'm back in the church. <laughs> oh, I just this episode has been an absolute disaster, hasn't it? I should just I should not have played. Still, I hope you've been entertained. Um, Lord knows I've not been, but we did, we, we, oh look, success, our pumpkins are growing, oh let's make some bone meal, oh look at them go, 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 go pumpkins, yay, oh there you go, some success on this dark day which has seen no success at all. Um, I killed some of the zombies. I killed some of the villagers, basically. Oh well. At least I don't have to worry about going into the nether anymore. Although I did, I did want to get some nether crack. 
and some glowstone so a portal is still on the cards but it's no longer the priority that it was 10 minutes ago I think I think we'll call that a day. Let's. Uh, I was going to talk about. I went to see the Avengers at the weekend. I was going to talk about that, but we kind of, we kind of got distracted by the fact that I have no idea how to play this game. So never mind. We'll uh, we'll try again tomorrow. We've built the we've built the pumpkin farm. I want to. I can't even remember what the other steps were now. I said I wanted to build a more established base here. We've established Heidi Hole as the construction base. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to go away and have a think and then we'll come back with a game plan. Oh, you can get up here. Okay, do some farming. Make some, get your inventories up. Can I see what's in your inventory? Is that something I can do? Come here. Here. You want 17 string, okay. I probably could do that actually. I probably have got string dotted around here, they're everywhere. What do you want? 28 paper, okay. Alright, they are farming at least, that's good. Um, so yeah, sorry that this episode has not gone even remotely according to plan, but such is the perils of live recording. At least, at least you know that <laughs> I'm not editing this in any way, shape or form. I probably should. I should probably just hide my shame, but but I shan't. You love potatoes, won't you? Yes. And Sunny's getting going, so we'll call that it. Thanks for watching. Uh, I'm going to go and curl up somewhere and cry. And I'll see you for episode 8. Ta-ta!